What's up guys, it's me, the buyers again. I'm here with a special video and guess what came in today? This came in today, the KSI box. We're gonna open this. This is my second video by the, I haven't bought a camera. I don't think I should invest yet, but I might just, I don't know yet. Comment below on, ooh. On what cameras do you think I should get? All right, so this is the invoice. Since everybody already like pretty much covered this, so I got my milk right here and I got water in here. So I'll just get a water and I'm gonna do a taste of both. So this is the box. It's actually, this is the box right here. Hello. The shaker, the box is really nice. The one thing I already saw that's kind of bummed me out, like, really? Really? Like, you really going to do this to us, G Fuel? Like, most of us, there's like about 30% of us that we're like addicted to G Fuel. And you guys, look, look at how many of those stickers I got. I have so many duplicates. Y'all need to start releasing like some of the OGs or some of the like new ones, but or at least something that goes with this box because... Some of them come with like snow cone came with its own, PewDiePie came with its own, TK came with its own. Like, come on, let's not get lazy, guys. Like, this product is worth what you guys are selling it for, maybe even more. Not saying you guys should. Oh, that lid looks pretty lit. The reason why I want a camera is so it can look right. I see like it's like opposite side, like a mirror. Ooh, I don't have a. This little scooper's orange. This is the first time we get one of these. Like, oh no, that's not true. Oh no, it is. It is. It's a different color orange because I have the Baja Mama up there, and it's different. It's a. This is like a darker orange. Shaker is lit. I like it. I like the fact that that the G Fuel has like inside color and all that. It looks nice. They're starting to come out with most of the the G Fuels like that. Like. The KSI logo looks freaking lit. I don't I don't care what anybody says. Yellow, clear, and orangey red always looks good. The inside, we're not gonna use this shaker just yet. Or no, we're not. We're not. We're not. Okay, wait a minute. Apologies, 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 G Fuel. So y'all gave me two stickers, one in the box. One in the box and one inside the box. I full apologies, like full, full. If you anybody from G Fuel is watching this, full apologies. This sticker is pretty lit. I'm not gonna lie. It looks like a bandana, kind of like you see, like the inside of it. This is freaking lit. I'm actually gonna keep. I have two more boxes coming in tomorrow. I thought they were all gonna come in today, but no, they came in tomorrow. They're gonna come in tomorrow, so I'm gonna keep the stickers for whoever wins the the boxes. Let me stack them up in my little sticker, and then of course you have the to go information and all that. And then this is the tub, guys. The artwork on this is pretty sick. What I want to know is if someone from that one competition did this. That's what I want to know. All right, well let's get to it. So we're gonna try both. And to whoever's wondering, yes, I have a ton of um, cans in here. I have Phase Berry in the bottom and I have Sour Cherry on top because those are my favorite two flavors. Um, I don't really like Rainbow Sherbet. Rainbow Sherbet's a little too sweet for me or I, I just don't like it in ge when it comes to um, the RTD version of it. Blue Ice, I just think that if I keep consuming the can, I'm just gonna lose interest in the powder because it really isn't the same formula. Now, Sour Cherry and Phase Berry, that's a whole different story. There's like, I don't know, it's just, wow. It, I don't know, it's just good. Just really, I don't know, I don't know. Oh, okay. guys, I don't know, guys. Okay, let's get this milk one. So we're gonna do both because this is a flavor that actually I always hope that they're always like right above and it is this one it is I don't have to lick my fingers that bad so don't at me on this 
but I, I, I don't like the top. To me personally, G Fuel, if, if you guys were to remove this top, you'd save, I don't know, whatever it costs, like a cent on these scoopers, because I rip them off. I don't need it. I know how to measure my own thing. I'm, I, we're, since we're going to do two of them, I don't need a period. We're going to do half a scoop on one. We're going to go milk first. And we're going to do another half a scoop on water. Now, it's a tradition of a real G Fuel fan that after you dip for the thing, you go, mm. Oh, not bad. It tastes like bubble gum. That wouldn't be a bad flavor anyways. That would not be a bad flavor. Should we do like that one exercise machine? And shake them both at the same time or one at a time? Alright, here goes water. I'm going to shake them both up. Just so we see the how it looks. Let's give it a little... Okay. Alright, so... This is what water, with water looks like. It kind of has like a... It's really fizzy in there though, even with water. It has like a raging gummy fish look. Alright, let's shake up the milk one. Milk's gonna get fuzzy regardless. That's so much milk has so much fat in it that it causes a fizziness, like the fuzzy, fizzy, whatever it's called. Okay, it doesn't have a dark color like strawberry shortcake. It has a light pink like Nesquik strawberry. You always have to shake it way more with um, milk because of the fat. Milk has fat. I don't know if you guys knew that, but milk has fat, so you guys have to keep shaking it. All right. So we got the water on the left and the milk on the right. This is what the milk tastes like. I mean, taste. Looks like water. Well, uh, we're going to go with water first. Let's see. All right, well... Smells all right. Dude. Good. It, okay, I'm not gonna overreact and go, oh my fucking God, shit, oh my, ah! like, no, it's good, it's good, it's good, guys. It's not like, whoa. Well, I only react like that when it's a real reaction to do, you know? Alright, so it's good. It tastes like a fruity punch type, but you can taste the difference within the banana and the strawberry. Like, you can, if you were able to just grab them like this and split them with your hand, you were able. That's how distinguishable the taste is. Alright, let's go the milk now. Alright, let's go. Okay, this one's a banger right here. Dude, okay, all right. Like I said, I'm not gonna scream like a crazy little kid. When I was a kid and my mom used to give me strawberry, banana, sh um, milkshakes in the morning, what's the first thing you taste when you're eat drinking it? The banana, you know how you feel? Th the only thing this thing is missing is the little threads that the banana comes with that are always left over inside the shake. Other than that, it tastes just like it. No lie, I guarantee, go freaking get this. Get it. This, If you like that, you know, like... The good thing about it is not like strawberry shortcake where water, ew, like I don't like it with water. Ooh, I. That's why I, my tub's still like brand new because I only drink it with milk, and that's when I feel like drinking it. But I don't want to run this video more than ten minutes, and we're already at the nine minute mark. So, just go get it if you like it. It it's ten out of ten. No, nine out of ten. Water brings it down, but it's still really good. But make sure you hit that like button, comment, subscribe. Give me a chance to see that YouTube is something that is worthwhile. Show me some love. I'm trying to do a little bit of both Twitch and YouTube. But, yeah, I might want to be giving away a bunch of stuff. Alright, man. Hey, I don't have a code. 
But go use my boy's code, SHOCK. SHOCK at gfuel.com. Later, guys.